Well, Guy Brush Threepwood, you do turn up in the strangest places. Uh, hi, Elaine. Uh, do you think you could help me out? How did you get into this mess? It's kind of a long story. Oh, that's okay. I've got time. Uh, well, it all started on Scab Island. Some of my admiring fans had pressured me into telling my LeChuck evaporating story once again. Deep in the Caribbean, Scab Island. So I bust into the church and say, Now you're in for it, you bilious bag of barnacle bait! And then LeChuck cries, Guybrush, have mercy! I can't take it anymore! I think I know how he must have felt. Yeah, if I hear this story one more time, I'm gonna be crying myself! Don't you have any new stories? Well, actually, that's why I'm here on Scab Island. I'm on a whole new adventure. Growing a mustache? No. Bigger than that. A beard? No, I'm in search of treasure. The biggest treasure of them all. A treasure so valuable and so well hidden that it haunts the dreams of every pirate on the seas. You mean... Big whoop? None other. Then why'd you come here? There's no treasure on Scab Island. Well, I didn't know that before. Now I'm trying to charter a ship and look someplace else. When I return, I'll have riches galore and a whole new story. Or you'll have died trying. Either way, we won't have to hear about LeChuck anymore. Ha! Those guys wouldn't know a good story even if they paid 50 bucks for it. When I find Big Whoop, I'll become a legend among pirates for generations to come. I can only charter a ship and get off this stinking island. Where do you think you're going, fancy pants? You ain't from these parts, are you? This is a toll bridge. You gotta pay. Who's gonna make me, shorty? Tough guy, huh? Help! Police! <laughs> Scream as loud as you want! There's no police on Scab Island. Then who eats the donuts and roughs up the transients? I roughs up on needs roughing up on this island. Whoa! Hey, you're loaded. This is my lucky night. Remember, wherever you go, on sea or on land, you can't ever hide from Lago Legrand! Tough town. I guess I should have got those traveler's checks. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Grog, please. A shaken, not stir. <laughs> Maybe you'd like a Shirley Temple instead. I'm old enough. Look at my beard. Ha! Ah, that's the oldest trick in the book. Tell you what, I'll let you have some near grog. Doesn't have any alcohol in it, but it's just as nasty smelling and foul tasting as that stuff grown ups drink. Right on. Oh, wait. What am I saying? I just sold the last of it to Kate. Sorry. Rats. Of course, if you have some ID. 
In that case, I'll take my business elsewhere. Oh, don't be sore, kid. It's the law. Let's just say I want to keep on the good side of it. Why? Because the law around here isn't the law at all. It's Largo. You know, I can mix any drink there is. Make anything you could name. But I can't make the one thing that could really do this island some good. What's that? A voodoo doll of Largo Le Grand. You there! Uh-oh. Give me my usual and put it in a real glass. Fork over the dough or you'll be serving Bloody Marys for a week. From your nose. That's all I have. Well, you better have more tomorrow. Or we might have to move this dump to a new location. Like, say, the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Boy, you just gave him all your money? I don't want to talk about it. Largo's been here. I don't want to touch it with my hands. That's sick. Hey! Hired help only! It reads, Jojo. Appearing nightly. No cover charge. Hello. I can't reach it. Uh, excuse me. Oh, uh, yes. Hi there. Can I help you? Hi, I'm Guybrush. Who are you? Wally. Wally B. Feed. At your service. Do you know anything about Big Whoop? Uh-oh! Who sent you here? I should warn you, I'm heavily armed. I was sent by the IRS. Let me see your files. The who? You better not try for my files. All my research on Big Whoop is in there. Can I see your files? Actually, there's not anything in them. I haven't really been able to find out much hard information. What do you know about it? I know its location is a mystery. You mean you never heard of the four men who buried it? Oh, them? Yeah, I know about them. Of course. Well, well. Guess you don't need me then. get that circus started? Do we know you? I'm Guybrush. You tried to sell me the minutes of a PTA meeting in the last game, claiming it was a map? Map? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. No, really. Why did you wake us up, Gorbush? Is that your rat? Yes. We call him Munster Monster because of his insatiable passion for cheese. What happened to your leg? It happened during a performance. That's what we do for a living now. 
You see, after our circus failed, we started a pirate catering business on nearby Fat Island. A sacking lunch. It was quite lucrative. Then what happened? The governor of the island made us an offer we, uh, <laughs> couldn't refuse. So, we sold him the business. What did you do with the money? We sank the money into one of those newfangled glass bottom boats. We wanted to take passengers on sightseeing trips. And search for a place called Drinky Island in our spare time. Boy, did we ever want to get there. Aside from the obvious reason, we had inside information that Drinky was in fact the resting place of the legendary treasure of Big Whoop. I don't see what this has to do with performing. We're getting to that. You see, we got a bit of a raw deal on the boat. Seems the salesman didn't have any glass for the bottom, so we just left a gaping hole there. By the time we noticed, we were taking on water, fast. We ended up stranded on a tiny desert island. I think it's past my bedtime. We met a philosopher on the island, and he told us something which changed our lives. That you should bore passers-by to tears with long stories? He told us that all the world is a stage and that we are merely players. So, we became performance artists. When he lost the leg, Frank was brilliantly showing the inseparability of the path man walks from the food chain. The symbolism of the cheese was essential. You know, this leg is looking sort of dingy. Would you get some polish over at the woodsmiths and polish it for me? Give me money for the polish. Okay. See you later. We can scarcely contain our anticipation. <laughs> <laughs>